guys, what's going on? It's Champion Dark Blaze here, and welcome back to the channel. And welcome back to the fifth and final episode of the Anime Card Gallery series. So far, we've gone through every single Yu-Gi-Oh! generation and looked at the anime cards that I've been able to find online and create in my spare time. And with four series done, we're on to the fifth installment of this series, Yu-Gi-Oh! Arc 5. Arc 5 is a personal favorite series of mine, and it did a lot of stuff right, such as having an atmosphere similar to Infinity War for most of the series. And it gave us cards such as Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon, Dark Rebellion XZ's Dragon, Clear Wing Synchro Dragon, Starving Venom Fusion Dragon. So today we're going to be taking a look at all the cards that I could find from the Arc 5 era, as well as some extra cards that I was able to find from other archetypes, as well as some cards I forgot to show in the past, as well as a Link Monster from Yu-Gi-Oh! Reigns. And with that being said, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to my channel, turn on the bell icon as well, and share this video with your friends. With that being said, let's take a look at some cards from Arc 5. Get ready to get your game on! Alright, so starting off the Card Gallery Arc 5 Edition, we have Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon, we have the Dimension Dragons of Dark Rebellion XZ's Dragon, Clear Wing Synchro Dragon, and Starving Venom Fusion Dragon. There's Dark Requiem XZ's Dragon, Clear Wing Crystal Dragon, this Clear Wing Monster that I don't remember the name of, but I'll put on screen. We have Beast Eyes Pendulum Dragon, Rune Eyes Pendulum Dragon, Odd Eyes Vortex Dragon, Odd Eyes Meteor Burst Dragon, Odd Eyes Absolute Dragon, and another Odd Eyes monster that I don't remember the name of that I'll put on screen. I will also mention that if you want to pause the video at any time in order to see the cards in more detail, please do so. We have Odd Eyes Rebellion Dragon, Odd Eyes Raging Dragon, a Performer Pal whose name I'll put on screen. We have Enlightenment Paladin, Nirvana High Paladin, Odd Eyes Lanzer Dragon, Odd Eyes Dragon, Odd Eyes Gravity Dragon, Odd Eyes Mirage Dragon, Smile World. We have Zark, both the real version and the anime version. We have the Supreme King versions to Dark Rebellion, Clear Wing, and Starving Venom and Odd Eyes. We have Time Gazer and Stargazer Magician. Again, pause the video if need be. We have Pendulum Reborn. We have the Magician cards for the Magician archetype that Yuya uses, such as Astrograph Sorcerer and Chronograph Sorcerer and Time Star Magician as well. We have some Dynamist Pendulum monsters, such as Stegosaurus, Tyranno, and Plesio, Brachio, Terra, and Triceratops as well. We have some Ignite Pendulum monsters as well. More Ignite Pendulum monsters, such as Ignite Champion, and then some other Magician Pendulum monsters, as well as some normal monsters from, I believe, the World Chalice archetype as well. But the cards do not stop here, there are just a few more. But let's recap the cards we've had so far. So again, we have the Dimension Dragons, some Odd Eyes Fusion, Xyz Synchro cards as well. We have more of Yuya's Extra Deck monsters, such as Enlightenment Paladin, Odd Eyes Rebellion Dragon, Odd Eyes Raging Dragon and Nirvana High Paladin. Zark, we have the Dimension Dragons, but in their Supreme King version, as well as Time Gazer and Stargazer Magician. Magician cards like Chronograph and Astrograph Sorcerers. We have Dynamis Pendulum Monsters and Ignite Pendulum Monsters as well. Then we have more Ignite Pendulum Monsters and Magician Pendulum Monsters with more Normal Monsters. But let's go into the other cards that I have as well. Here we have a lot of DD and Triple D monsters as well. We have Triple D Flame King Genghis, Gust King Alexander, High Wave King Caesar, Dark, High King Gust King Alexander, Triple D Marksman King Tell, Oblivion King Abyss Ragnarok, Duo Don King Kaliuga, DD Burfamet. And again, pause the video if need be. We have Pendulum Swing, we have Triple D Rebel King Leonidas, we have Ragnarok, some a Gladiator Beast, Galaxy Eyes Xyz Monsters, we have some Fusion Monsters as well. We have Raid Raptor, Super Heavy Samurai, Blackwing, Raid Raptor cards that are Xyz cards as well. So this is Raid Raptor Rise Falcon.
Raid Raptor Burner Falcon and Ultimate Falcon, Satellite Falcon. And then we get into all the Performer Pals that Yuya likes to use. These are also the Performer Pals that look a lot like different Pokemon in the Pokemon world. For instance, Performer Pal Lizard Draw and Whip Snake look like Charmander and Ekans respectively. Performer Pal Hip Hippo. Performer Pal Part Naga, Performer Pal Skull Crobat Joker and Silver Fang, Performer Pal Mon Keyboard, one of the best ones we have right here, these two. We have Performer Pal Drumorilla and Bubble Bow Wow, Performer Pal Cheermo even, and Trump Witch. Again, pause if need be. We have Xiang Sheng Xiang K Magician, Performer Pal Arai's Light Phoenix, Performer Pal Trump Girl, Performer Pal Inflator Tapir, Performer Pal Guitardle, Camelump, Swing Cobra, Paratrio, one of the best. Performer Pal Wim Rich and Horseradish, Pyro Lobster and Muffle Lion. Performer Pal Slight Hand Magician and Dag Daggerman over there. And Performer Pal King Bear. Nearing the end, we have Performer Pal Sky Magician, Performer Pal Coin Dragon, Performer Pal Odd Eyes Dissolver, Performer Pal Rainbow Magician, and then some cards I forgot in other eras. From 5Ds, I forgot to add in Jung Synchron and Quick Draw Synchron as well. Then we have Paladin of Dark Dragon for the OG era, and then some other Necroz cards such as Necroz Sorcerer and Necroz of Sophia. Then, the Link monster I was able to find from Yu-Gi-Oh! Vrains is none other than Decode Talker. And I'm really happy I found this card in anime version. But that is going to do it for the Yu-Gi-Oh! Card Gallery Arc 5 Edition and the Yu-Gi-Oh! Card Gallery series as a whole. And there we go guys, those are all the anime Yu-Gi-Oh cards I was able to find from the Arc 5 era. I hope you enjoyed, and let me know what your favorite anime cards were from this episode. Yu-Gi-Oh Brains has ended in Japan, and the Yu-Gi-Oh 7s has also started, but I haven't been able to find any anime cards from Yu-Gi-Oh Brains. If more anime cards do appear online, I will definitely make those anime cards, and make a 6th episode for Yu-Gi-Oh Brains. But until that happens, this will be the last episode in this series. I hope you did enjoy, thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and share this video with your friends. I will be posting more content on Tuesdays and Fridays. So I'll be back with another video soon, and until then, pick up a deck and start dueling. I'll catch you guys later.